funeral. Everybody is on the way. It's all planned. We cannot delay the funeral. We have to. We can't bury Ella without her father being there. We need to say goodbye to Ella today. I know you were like a mother to her, but Warren is her actual father. Don't push me on this, Cindy. If you know what's good for you, you will stay out of my way today. No, but will you please just listen? Cindy, I am asking you this one thing as a mother. And I am telling you as a mother that... Too late. So I reckon I'll be done when you decide to tell me the truth. Did Felix shoot you? Who cares? He's gone, the coward. His baby will be better off without him. I heard Mercedes was pregnant, but I didn't realise it was... And you ran him out of town knowing that he had a baby on the way? He killed my daughter. Then why was he only arrested for dangerous driving? Cos the old bill around here are hardly the sharpest, are they? No offence. They found you all right, didn't they? They're waiting outside right now to take a statement about your gunshot wound. Oh, you're joking. Look, I've got places I need to be. So you're not going to tell them that it was Felix that shot you? Because there's going to be no lasting damage as long as you finish your antibiotics. And it's only going to lead to more questions. They're going to want to know where did the gun come from and... I'm not a grass. Patients are yours. I just can't believe it's happening. I can't get over the fact she's gone. How do you think Charlie's holding up? Unexpected. His anxiety must be in overdrive. He seems to be dealing with it. Amazing, really. He's so resilient. They all are. So are you. I know you're very fond of her, too. Come on, now. She only gave us a grandchild, bless her. Warren said he just needs a few more minutes. What difference does it make to you if we delay the service a little? How selfish are you? Everybody is in pain, and you want to prolong it for Warren Fox. He has the right to be here for his daughter. The world doesn't stop for your son. Hey, come on now. Norma is Ella's grandma. I think she deserves a say. And what's a few minutes? And we all know Ella would want Warren there. Someone needs to stand in for Charlie. Steve. Steve, please. That's my daughter. That's my job. Ran a little bit ahead to make sure all the refreshments are ready. They're gonna need them. Go have a seat. I'll get the drinks, all right? Get two beers, please. This lot don't even want me here. Well, I do. You're nice and fun for Ella, yeah? Oh, I don't think that's a good idea. Yeah, well, I do. I need a few before I go and see Mercedes. Please tell me you're not leaving your daughter's wake to go and see that woman. I need to talk to her. Well, you've changed your tune. Why waste more time on her? She's brought you nothing but misery. Let her get through her pregnancy and take your baby and goodbye, Mercedes. Dog, but Diane said he didn't even make it to the funeral. Hey, I've got a tab open at the loft. Do you fancy it? I'm pregnant, remember? Ah, you didn't make it to the dog either. Where's Felix? Give us a minute, T. 
I need a disco nap anyway. Just tell me where he is, and I'll leave. Cayman Islands. That's what he told me. It's just some kind of game to you. Do I look like I'm having fun to you? No, Warren, I'm scared. I'm scared of what you're gonna do. To you? Nothing. Yesterday, yeah. No, I wanted payback for you betraying me. What's that? It's like you've got this hold over me. It's called love. Is that why you help Felix get away? No. You still love him, don't you? No, I love you. And that is why I was trying to stop you making a mistake by taking his life. He killed my daughter! He didn't mean to. It wasn't his fault. No. But it was your fault she was drunk. And you are never gonna let that go. All you want is revenge. No. It's not. I want us. You, these babies. And I'm sorry. I can't risk it. Not if you kill Felix. Come on, Warren. You're a grown man who still thinks that violence is the answer. Someone always ends up getting hurt. Yeah. And this time it's me. Oh, that picture you sent to Tony was gorgeous. What picture? Oh, Tony shares a photo of the pub and you're looking dead glam in the background. Ella was such a lovely girl. Living with her really brought the best out in Cindy. I'm just glad Bandy's flowers with her. Ella would have loved them. Did you miss me? I've been working on my speech. Now, now is, is not the time. What would you rather me have got up in the church and give it both barrels? I'd only known that Ella was mine for a few months. I'd missed out on 16 years of her life and now she's gone. Killed by my best mate, Felix. Where is Felix? You know, he might have been driving the car that ran her down, but you are all to blame! You are? What kind of a community lets a little girl run drugs, sends her to prison, and then buries her before she's even grown up? That's enough. We know how you feel. Believe me, everybody in this room wishes things were different. Let's go. Yeah. That is the best thing that I've heard all day. You know, this place makes me feel sick. You all do. Warren! Where are you going? I only meant leave the pub, not the village. I need to sell a score. That I can understand. Fine, I'll keep the garage ticking over and I'll watch over Sophie and Sebastian like a hawk. I'm Mercedes, and the babies. Oh, don't you worry. I'll be keeping tabs on her for sure. Well, I guess there's only one thing left for me to do. Go, and uh, when you come back, I'll be here waiting for you. Warren! Wait. I just wanted to say how sorry I am about Ella. I can't imagine how I'd feel if it was Leah or Lucas. Yeah, well, it wasn't, was it? Luckily for you. Where are you going? Manchester Airport, mate. Well, anywhere nice? I don't know. But when I get back, this place won't know what's it. So to catch up on all the latest drama in the Hollyoaks village, you need to click here to watch full episodes or here to get some little snippets of what's been going on. Do not forget to subscribe.